So, we're going to do the long tail cast on and start with a slip knot. The slip knot, like so. I'm going to bring the yarn that's on the top, underneath, and through the loop. And if there's a knot that slips, so when I put the needle in, there's my first stitch. Okay, so I only need a needle in my right hand or my working hand and on this hand I'm going to pretend that my thumb is the needle to help me make the stitch. The thumb comes from the back to the front, twists and you knit into that stitch with the working yarn. So it takes two threads to make that stitch. This tail here and the working yarn. So again I'm going to bring the thumb from the back to the front underneath that yarn, twist and knit into that stitch with the other yarn and again from the back to the front, twist and knit with the other yarn. When you're doing it for socks or actually when you're doing it for anything try not to um, make the stitches too close up to each other. That would be called a tight cast on. Instead, allow there to be a little bit of yarn between each stitch like so, so that we get a nice loose cast on.